Revelation 2508. From the 12th of October 1942. Arrogance. Darkness. Ray of light. Truth. Deep darkness weighs upon humanity, and the sign of it is wrong thinking and arrogance. Anyone with an arrogant spirit does not check whether he is in the truth, and if he thus errs he does nothing to free himself from it. He who seeks finds. But he who believes himself to be infallible does not seek the truth and will therefore never find it either. To possess the truth means to walk in the light, but error is darkness. For this reason God sometimes lets a light shine so that it breaks through the darkness and people are shown the benefit of a ray of light, that is pure truth is offered to a person from the kingdom of the one who is truth in himself, and where truth is, error will also be recognized as such, the light shines brightly in the darkness. And now the human being is free to remain with the truth or to return to error thus to sink into the night of the spirit again. But for the most part people flee the light, the truth. They don't want to let go of what they possess as spiritual property although it contradicts the truth, because they are arrogant and don't want to acknowledge anything that goes beyond their knowledge. And that is why it is so difficult to bring the truth to people. If they would examine everything with a childlike mind, consider everything and then accept what stands up to their scrutiny, then their knowledge would be much closer to the truth. But as it is, every bearer of truth is attacked out of the instinctive feeling that his knowledge is greater, and thus humanity remains in darkness, it extinguishes the light because it shuns it. And even if God repeatedly lights a little light which is to shine for humanity, it does not recognize the blessing of it and carelessly passes it by or only eagerly endeavors to dim its bright glow. The ray of light is a blessing for people who desire to walk in the light, and they also gratefully accept this blessing, but there are only a few of them, they are predominantly people who lack worldly knowledge, for worldly knowledge is likewise a light which appears bright enough to them. But it is not capable of breaking through the darkness of night. But because they believe they possess a light, they do not desire to illuminate their spiritual state, and thus humanity continues to walk in darkness, which, however, has an immeasurably painful effect on it. Amen.